How to fix Fortnite Chapter 4 FPS drop, lag and input delays. If you're currently playing Fortnite and having a lot of lags or input delays, here is a video and I'm gonna show you how you can fix all these problems and boost FPS in your game. The first and foremost thing which you need to remember is whether you're playing on Nvidia or AMD, make sure to have all your drivers up to date. The graphics driver, after you have updated, it will fix majority of the problems, at least 40 to 50% of your problems of lag or FPS. So make sure to see whether your drivers is up to date or not for your graphic card which you're currently using. The second step which you need to do is, what you have to remember is you have to open your Epic Games Launcher which as you can currently see on my screen and here as you can see I have not updated Fortnite here because I don't play Fortnite on this computer which I have but I can show you the step. What you have to do is you have to click on this three dots over here and then you have to go to options which is over here. Make sure that by mistake if you have done this make sure to untick the high resolution textures because right now we are more concerned about how to boost our performance and boost the FPS and we don't want the highest clarity for the game. So make sure to untick the high resolution textures and choose apply over here. One more thing in the Epic Games launcher which you can do is you have to go to your account on here and then click on settings and then scroll down to the very bottom and as you can see, these are the games which I have installed currently on this. First and foremost, you have to click on this small little inverted triangle right next to Fortnite and then tick on this additional command line arguments and you have to type this which is dash lan dash use all available cores. So what this will do is use all available cores, whatever cores your CPU have, we are giving it completely to Fortnite. The next step which you can do is you have to come to your search bar over here and type in run and here you have to type percentage temp percentage as you can see and you have to click ok it will open all the temporary files which are present on your computer and it's just eating space which is not required select everything and just permanently delete them not only it will clean up your space from your pc but it will also give the performance which you're looking for the next thing what you have to do is you have to go in the search bar again and type in run here this time you have to type percentage app data percentage and click ok once app data loads click on app data at the top here and go to local scroll down you will find fortnite game which is here and then go to saved and then you have to click on config windows client you will find a text file which is called as game user settings right click go to properties make sure that read only is not ticked it will be ticked by default so untick it click on apply click ok double click and open it and two settings which you have to be very careful here is that the first one is this one as you can see b show grass this will be true by default make sure to make it false so make sure that b show grass is false this will give you quite a lot of performance boost after you've changed this the next thing what you have to do is you have to scroll down to the complete bottom here and you will find a word which is called as SG dot resolution quality. This will be 100%. You can make it a little bit less. It will not have much of an effect on the quality, but it will give a lot of effect on the performance. I would suggest you to put on 90 or 92, depending on what computer you have. You can choose any value between 90 and 95. I'm putting on 92 and just simply go to file, save it, close this make sure to right click go to properties and choose read only and apply over here the next step what we will do is we will change our power plans in our computer to the ultimate performance what you have to do is go to the start button and you will find here right click and you will find here windows powershell which is an admin version so make sure you click on that and once it has opened you have to just paste this particular command which you see over here i've already done it so i'm not going to do it again but you can pause the screen right now and just simply write it or it will be there in the description box as well you can take it from there just simply press enter and once you have done this what will happen is when you go ahead to the power options from this particular corner here you will see that i have a thing which is called as ultimate performance so i can just choose it and then i can play the game i will get a quite a lot of fps boost just by using this so those were some simple steps which will help you a lot in boosting the fps lowering down the input delay in fortnite chapter 4 if this video was helpful please don't forget the like button comment your suggestions if you have any other steps which will help others if you're new to my channel consider subscribing hitting the bell icon i'll see you in the next video thank you so much for watching Bye bye